Hey everybody. So our aquaponics system is finally set up again after years. Many people involved here. Johan Flores. <laughs> it's on. Your work is not in vain. <laughs> Johan put a good amount of time into emptying all the things out of that boat and covered in fiberglass a bunch of times. So his pain has been realized. So we went to um, Seminole County Parrot Rescue. And this was full after here. I had to empty some water so I could move it. But there's probably a couple hundred fish in there. Uh, all tilapia right out of the pond at our wonderful friend Ellen's house. So here we go. The stocking process. Farm style. Yeah. Yeah, that's cute. We're going uphill like salmon. Boom! Is there any more in there? No, that's it. And that's it. We're stopped. A couple hundred fish, probably. Something like that. Every time I threw the net, I was getting like 10, and I threw the net a bunch of times. So there's a whole bunch of fish that are all loading up down at the end. Now we just build the system, get these full lava rocks. They should be pretty happy in here. We did this before in this very boat, actually. Um, on the YouTube channel, there's a, a video when the boat was above ground, but it got too cold and everything froze. The fish all died. I think it hit like 40 or 41 one day, and that was it. They all died. So I took it all apart then, and that was, God, that was a long time ago, huh? Two, three years ago, I think. And uh, waiting to put it in the ground, the ground will keep it warmer and no more problems like that. We definitely think we should do the rocks like you were saying. Granite chips. Kelly said granite there's some sort of white rocks in the bottom to keep it pretty so you can see the fish better. We should do something. But now it's going so Let's see where it goes from here. Jack gets the fish out here now. That's always pretty fun. Fish tacos. We used to do that a lot. Jack would come out when we had the other system and he would catch the bigger one. And we would have fish tacos right out of our own little boat. So. All right, on to the next project.